COVID has claimed more than 600,000 lives in the United States, and researchers calculate that for every 13 deaths caused by the virus, one child under 18 years old has lost a parent, and that would translate into more than 46,000 children now. So as we face yet another surge of COVID cases, I spoke to a pediatric psychologist who shares the warning signs a child needs help after losing a parent. When we talk about childhood resiliency all the time, and it's true, kids can be very resilient, adults can be very resilient, but it takes the support of a family or a support network in order to make that happen. Dr. Lacey Chavis is a pediatric psychologist at Johns Hopkins All Children's Institute. And with over 46,000 children losing one or both parents to COVID-19 since March of 2020, she says we need to pay attention to the signs a child needs help. Changes in eating behaviors um, that don't kind of resolve with a little bit of time and the support and love of the family around the child. Those would be some really good times to seek out additional support. And the traumatic loss of a parent can lead to other issues, especially if that child does not receive the help and support they need. Other warning signs include reduced academic performance, defiant or aggressive behavior, socially withdrawing, and increased anxiety or depression. And if you are the surviving caretaker of that child and you're also grieving, Chavis says, be honest about your own suffering. I'll open that dialogue with the child and say, you know, I hurt too and I grieve too, but I want to, you to know that I'm here for you. And if you have a teenager who's not talking to you, Chavis says that's quite normal, but don't stop communicating. But you want to open the dialogue. Um, let them know that you are there for them and that you are willing to talk about it and you want to talk about it with them when they're ready and how they want to talk about it. Meanwhile, there are many bereavement programs in Florida and the National Alliance for Grieving Children lists grief support service providers who serve children, teens and their families. And on that page, there are countless resources, including free bereavement counseling sessions for adults and children, free grief support groups for adults and kids and free weekend bereavement camps for children and teens. We've shared that link on our website at abcactionnews.com slash rebound.